think people often have the impression that our choice is that we either continue on with business as usual and, 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 and enjoy the, the, the opulent lifestyles that we've, that we've been able to enjoy for the last 50 years or suffer the pain of going through some sort of transition away from, from fossil fuel based economies. But, but that's, that's not really the choices that we have. Our, our, our future, whether we choose to accept it or not, is, is filled with turmoil because we are facing dangerous climate change and we're also facing peak oil, meaning a decline in, in the conventional sources of, of, of energy that, that have fostered uh, the spectacular uh, wealth generation that we've enjoyed for the last 50 years. Those trends are happening whether we like it or not. So, so it's, not, it's not a question of, you know, do we choose to continue to enjoy the good life or not? That good life is coming to an end no matter what. Uh, and so our choice is to either plan for the changes that are already taking place and do our best to navigate through them in a way that our, our quality of life uh, and, and, and our civilized societies maintain some function and structure or we can continue to deny that those changes are happening and, 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 and go about our, our, our business and, and, get, and get caught um, get, end up getting hit by the truck. So there, there's just there's no place for denial and good strategic future planning. 